What's up everybody and welcome back to Easy Stock Investing. In today's video, we're going to be talking about support.com stock, ticker symbol SPRT. Now support.com stock is down over 40% over the past week. It has seen a major run up and now a major crash down. So if you're interested in support.com stock, what do you do? Is it time to take profits or cut some losses? Is it time to load up on support.com stock in hopes for a short squeeze play? I will try to answer these questions and more in today's video. So if you enjoy the video, make sure to give it a thumbs up and help me out with that YouTube algorithm. And if you're new around here and you want to get notified every time I upload a video, all you got to do is hit that red subscribe button and join the family of investors. I am not a financial advisor and this is not financial advice. If you're going to invest in any stock we talk about on this channel, you must first do your own research and do your own due diligence. If you want to take advantage of some free stocks from Robinhood or Webull, those links are in the description below. But without further ado, let's hop right into support.com stock. So SPRT stock is up over 170% in the past three months. And I'm going to be upfront and honest with you guys right away. We are not going to pull any punches here. I realistically think that the ride for support.com is over now and I know a lot of you aren't going to like to hear that but all I can do is give you guys my honest opinion and at this point in time that is what my opinion is. Shares of support.com tumbled 16.5% in afternoon trading Friday after soaring 34.8% over the past two sessions. This came on the heels of the customer and technical support service company saying its shareholders approved the deal to be acquired by Bitcoin mining company Greenwich Generation Holdings. The stock has now pulled back 40% since it closed at a 17 year high of $36.39 on August 30th. This came after a meme like rally that took the heavily shorted stock up over 364% in two weeks. Shares of support.com or SPRT are trading significantly lower on above average volume. The stock just continues to pull back following recent strength. The average session volume over the last 100 days is about 17.5 million shares traded. The volume approached 25 million shares traded on Tuesday alone. Now the stock has been circulated as a potential short squeeze candidate on social media and the short float currently sits at 6.1 million shares. Support.com stock surged higher amid increased retail investor interest about three weeks ago. However, the stock has been trading lower since the beginning of September. The most recent downtrend began after shareholders approved a merger with Greenridge Holdings the merger is expected to close and become effective after the market closes on Tuesday. So let's be very realistic here, guys. This is a very clear example of buying the hype and selling the news, okay? Three weeks ago, when this thing started to take off, it was fueled by the momentum of this merger actually happening. And people were buying the hype, not to mention the short squeeze attention it was getting at the same time. If you are going to hop in on support.com stock, that probably would have been the appropriate time when everyone was buying the hype. I am very sorry to say this guys because I know a lot of you are very high on support.com and you had big dreams of where this thing could go. But for me, that time is officially over. The merger hype is over and now that it has actually happened, everyone is selling the news. I'll be honest with you guys. I never contemplated investing in support.com because I'm just not a short squeeze play kind of person. It's not the type of investor I am. So for those of you that think that support.com stock has more room to run because there is potential short squeeze play, you are more than welcome to go follow your favorite hype investor on YouTube. I am sure they will be plugging this one until the end. However, I cannot sit here and intelligently tell you guys that support.com stock is a good buy or that you need to hang on to this one because honestly I believe the ship has sailed on support.com stock. I would not fault anyone that takes profits or cuts any losses with support.com stock at this point in time. 
And the last and most important reason why I think the ship has sailed on support.com stock is the fact that the ticker is no longer tradable. If you want a piece of support.com, you're going to have to invest in Greenridge Generation Holdings. Ticker symbol G-R-E-E. -E. Anyways, guys, that's going to be the end of my little rant about support.com stock. I want to thank all of you that watched it all the way to the end. If you did enjoy the video, make sure to give it a thumbs up and help me out with that YouTube algorithm. If you're new around here and you want to get notified every time I upload a video, all you got to do is hit that red subscribe button and join the family of investors. We are growing every day. Let me know in the comments below what you guys think about support.com stock or Greenwich Generation Holdings. I always love to hear from you guys. If you want to take advantage of some free stocks from Robinhood or Weeble, those links will always be in the description below. I hope you all have a beautiful rest of your day, and I hope to catch every single one of you on my next video. Peace.